What's up guys and welcome to a new video. Uh, we're gonna do a Q&A video today since you guys had some questions for me. So we're gonna answer them. Um, the first question comes from Bauke and he asks, What is your favorite map and gun in Battlefield history? What is your dream job and what is your favorite car in GTA 5? Uh, my favorite map of all time would have to be Oasis in Bad Company 1. I really like that map and I played it to death really. Uh, my favorite gun of all time in Battlefield history, either the M24 or the SV98 sniper rifle. Uh, so yeah. What is your dream job? Uh, video editor, obviously, for um, either a company like Vice. I nearly had my internship there. And that's a really, really cool news company. Uh, or for a video game developer like Codemasters or, or DICE, obviously. Um, and what is my favorite car in GTA 5? I don't remember the exact name of it, but is the um, it is obviously the uh, the Bentley Continental GT uh, replica kind of thing. I'm sure you know which one I mean, Th that one. And then his second question is, how would your life look like with unlimited Ronku? Um, I would be living in Greece, probably with a really nice view from my house, with a pool in the backyard, um, that kind of stuff. And then his third and final question is, what is the secret behind your beard? What? And then Jinx has a question for me, and it is, what is love? What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. There you go, man. There you go. <laughs> Next question comes from Tizzinator. How old were you when you started playing video games, and what game was it? Interesting question. I don't really remember how old I was. Uh, and which game exactly was the first one I ever played, but I'm thinking I'm thinking it was either FIFA 97 on the PlayStation 1 or that video game called Spyro I don't know if any of you remember um, I had a purple dragon in it and you could jump around and do things <laughs> with them I don't really remember but Spyro was one of the first games uh, That can I can really remember playing myself so I don't know how old I was, but that was one of the first games I've ever played. And then Nova Sinful asks, what do you look like without a beard? Show a picture. Now, of course, I could go ahead and show you a picture, but it'd be so much more interesting to just, you know, do it live, right? I'm just, just kidding. We're not gonna, we're not, fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck you, Sinful. Halo Wars asks, why are you such a scrub? That's so rude, man. That's so rude. Then Dark Betrayed with a really interesting question. No, why would I want to you questions? That's the question. What? You Norwegian people, man, I swear. You're so weird. Your favorite Battlefield title. I know it already, but it might be interesting for others. Uh, my favorite Battlefield title of all time is Bat Company 1 on the Xbox 360. I have over 1,200 hours playtime in that game. It's this one right here. This one, I've played this so much, it's absolutely crazy, over 1200 hours, definitely my favorite Battlefield title of all time, and definitely my favorite game of all time as well. So there you go. Then BF asks, why the name Nova? Love from France. Thanks, man. Uh, why the name Nova? It's a really good question that I don't even have an answer to. I really don't know. Um, <laughs> I think it doesn't even have like a real meaning. I think it was just a cool name that uh, he came up with the the leader, the founder Hendrik. Um, it was founded in December 2012, and I joined in October-ish 2013. So I'm definitely not one of the first members. But there you go. Then Rupee asks, "Is your beard gay?" Because I want to marry it. Just kidding. Um, I'm not sure. I don't think so. But uh, I'll take the compliment. <laughs> Thank you. Then Frost asks, "How do you satisfy Minder?" Well, apart from uh, repping his, uh, his awesome merchandise, of course, uh, I satisfy him mostly with my Longhorn. Then Block asks, why do you hate Panacrop? I mean, Block, come on, man. Um, I mean, why do I hate Panacrop? Like, is it really not obvious just yet why I hate Panacrop? Like, I don't, know, I don't know what to say, man. I don't know what to say. Next question comes from Apple and I. He's a few questions, but his first question is, what happened to the guy playing FIFA in the background? <laughs> we don't see him much anymore. Right. When I used to stream, because uh, I... Well, I didn't really stop streaming, but I haven't done it in a while. But in the beginning of my streaming days, if you will, 
my best friend came over to play FIFA on my PlayStation 4 and then I started streaming and he just finished his game and then went home. Um, I finished or I finished I sold my uh, PS4 so he can't really play FIFA at my house anymore so that's pretty much why. Then Shaduga asks what's your most and least favorite things about the Battlefield community? Really interesting question. Um, my most favorite thing about the Battlefield community is I think the sheer passion that most of us have for the franchise or have had or whatever. Uh, the fact that we as a community kind of pushed the night maps and showed it to the devs that it really has, you know, uh, a, a valuable addition to the game and that they actually implemented it as well because they because they agreed with us. I think it's really cool that so many of us have, uh, you know, a sheer passion for the franchise. I think that is, that is really, really cool. And my least favorite thing about the Battlefield community, I think it's just with every community that every community has some kind of hate flowing through it. Uh, there's always trolls, there's always people hating on whatever you do. And I mean, it's there in CSGO, it's in, it's in COD, obviously. Uh, FIFA definitely as well. And I mean, yeah, that's pretty much it. I pretty much the hate, I guess. GH Gaming asks, can you give me a shout out? No, I can't do that. Then Zero, my good friend Zero Noins asks, how to be Nova, Nova Zero Hype. Um, I'll link my paper on the description below. Dogman asks, what is your favorite game of all time? Plus, do you use any beard oil on that outstanding facial hair? <laughs> Thanks, man. I appreciate that. Uh, my favorite game of all time is, as I've already said, Bad Company 1 on the Xbox 360, most definitely. And I do use beard oil on my beard because it keeps it shiny, I guess. I don't know. Intrepid asks, what are your top three games right now and are you working on an edit right now? I am working on an edit, it's for Nova Boogly. It's gonna be a multi Battlefield montage, a Battlefield 3, 4 and Hardline. So that's gonna be pretty interesting to see. And then what are my top three games right now? Um, right now I would have to say uh, number one, definitely CSGO. And let's see, number two, Dirt Rally, I think. And then number three, probably GTA 5 as of right now. The Magus has a few questions. If you had to rate your skill in bed with a clip, what type of clip would you be? Very interesting questions, but you know, I feel kind of uh, weird answering that for myself. So uh, let's just go ahead and look at some reviews. Can you tell people to subscribe to my channel? Uh, I would, but you upload COD, so, you know. Favorite games? Uh, my favorite game of all time, Bad Company 1, as you know. Bad Company 2 is another game I really enjoy. enjoyed. Uh, FIFA 11, Skyrim, GTA 5, CSGO, Dirt 3, Dirt Rally, that's pretty much it. And then Apple Not with another question, top 5 movies. Um, I don't really think I have a top 5 of my favorite movies ever. I have a top 1. If that counts, um, would have to be the original 300, of course, obviously, as you can see. And Kieran with uh, two questions. What do you enjoy doing most in Dirt Rally and what are your favorite pizza toppings? Uh, what do I do? What do I enjoy most in Dirt Rally? I think it is um, racing the Greek tracks, obviously, with the um, Group B cars, because those are just insanely fast. and. The track is so tricky, uh, so that's probably my favorite thing to do in the ready as of right now. Favorite pizza toppings? I don't think I have favorite pizza toppings. I usually just go for a margarita because that's my favorite pizza ever. And then a second question, what has that been like being a Greek in the Netherlands food-wise? Um, well, that's interesting because I was born in the Netherlands uh, and I've lived in Greece for only one year, one and a half years, which I really can't remember because I was really really young so i've i've been grow i've been growing up with dutch food all my life pretty much uh i don't like it that much to be honest uh i prefer greek food but uh you know you, you gotta do what you gotta do i can i can deal with it it's all right then my good friend enta asks what are your inspirations and what are your best sources for ideas well when it comes to montages because i think your question is related to montage making um my inspirations are uh, well, your own montage, for example, uh, Emotions 1 and 2, both of them, 
Uh, but I also take uh, inspirations from people like uh, Ben Brown, Casey Neistat. Uh, those are both two vloggers and they do completely different kind of stuff than me. But it's really interesting to see just the way they go about things. And uh, I think we can all learn a lot from them. Um, when it comes to my source for ideas, I don't think I really have a source for ideas. I just often I come up with ideas in the, on the train, just listening to music and looking at the window <laughs> as poetic as that sounds. That's usually the case uh, for me. Then Callum asks, why did you start YouTube? Or what is your favorite food? And did you ever see a shark in Greece? Because I didn't yet. Why did I start YouTube? Um, I started YouTube because I wanted to try montage as well. I used to watch uh, Small Beans uh, and he made uh, cod, cod montages and I wanted to try that as well, but for Battlefield. So that's why I started making YouTube videos. What's your favorite food? That's a really tricky question, man. Um, I think I'm gonna have to go with probably moussaka. It's a Greek dish, so there you go. And then, did I ever see a shark in Greece? No, I've never seen a shark in Greece, but I've seen multiple dolphins and sea turtles, if that counts. Kyver asks, does the beard make you or break you? Depends on the day, man. It depends on the day. And then my good friend Trainfart with the next question, which one is your favorite battlefield and why isn't it 1942? Well, Train, as I've already explained a few times in this video, uh, Battlefield by Company 1 is my favorite uh, Battlefield game of all time. Why isn't it Battlefield 1942? I have actually never played it. Yeah, so there you go. And then two people were stupid enough to text me questions instead of tweet me them, so there you go. Uh, Matt with the first question. Um, two places to live, one to chill, one to party, where would they be? One to chill, definitely in Greece. Doesn't even matter a lot where in Greece, as long as in Greece, then we're good. One to party, I think I'm gonna go with New York, either Amsterdam or New York. Amsterdam is really good as well, but I'm gonna go with New York probably. And Danny on PC with the last question, what is your favorite beer? My favorite beer would have to be Mythos. It's a Greek brand. It's kind of, if you're Dutch, it's kind of a mix between, a kind of a blend between uh, Heineken and Gros. Um, so that is probably my favorite beer uh, of all time. So those were all the questions for today's Q&A. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, we can do these more often, I guess. If you guys have any more questions, you can always tweet them at me. I usually reply to every tweet I get. And that's been all for now. Uh, and I'll see you all in the next video.